going on guys Matt from mythic gaming with another uh, minecraft xbox seed for you and I'm sure you can tell by the description that this is yet another double spawner seed <clears throat> excuse me another double spawner seed so let me as always give you the map and yes it is about 50% desert but uh that's all right you know you do what you got to do it doesn't take away from the map that much I mean I don't not a big fan of desert but I do notice I use it a lot so I'm not gonna complain and as you can see, uh, before we get to the, the best part of this map, I do want to run over to the other villages because there are three on this map and just kind of give you the coordinates for them in case you want to use uh, one of them instead or just run over there and get the stuff out of the blacksmith because I'm pretty sure at least one of them has a blacksmith. So let me shoot over to the one that's in the plains first and we'll take a look at that one. Yep, see this one does have a blacksmith. <clears throat> so here's your coordinates for this one. Kind of off by itself. I mean, it's, uh, it's not far from spawn. If I remember correctly, spawn is somewhere on the far side of the jungle, so closer to the desert. But, again, it's really not that far off. So now we will make our way towards the bottom of the map. So I can go to the other desert village, the one that is not full of awesome. But, again, a village, so I can't really leave it out. And actually, yeah, there was one right here. I completely forgot. So that, that makes four villages on this map. I don't know why I forgot about this one. I've seen so many seeds recently that... You know, sometimes they get away from you. And this one's actually pretty neat. I can't believe I forgot about this one. But if you go to these coordinates, you get this nice little village. You know, no blacksmith. But there is a partially covered surface ravine. And I'm sure you can tell already by that post there. If you go over here, there is an exposed mine shaft in this ravine. So this is another great place to set your base if you really felt like it. Because, I mean, you've got a mine shaft right here ready for exploring with everything you need. You know, you got iron, coal. All that great stuff and there's a village too so you've already got your your safety and all that fun stuff but we have to get back to this other village because this is the one that uh makes this map this is the, the most unique part of this map and as you know by now i love maps that are unique so let's get back over here and i'll hit you with these coordinates when i get here we're not far off spawn like i was saying spawn is right over on like the edge of the desert by the or the edge of the jungle by the river where it meets the desert so not far away and as you can see I am standing on a blacksmith so that's even better but it gets better than that because if you go over here I'm sure you can tell by now if you've been watching my videos that this is a stronghold mark I know I used to use stronghold blocks but I guess I've been getting lazy recently but this is the stronghold so you come right down here and boom right into the end portal and here's your coordinates for that even though it's pretty simple to find I mean I'm pretty sure it covers the whole bottom of the the village so just tunnel down in the village, tunnel around, you would find it, even without these coordinates. But there is still one more great part to this map, and it's going to be right off in this direction. I'll leave the map up, but just so uh, you can get the coordinates, even though you'll find it yourself. But your coordinates are going to be right here. Eh, pretty much, I mean, I'm on top of it. Obviously, the number can change one or two, it doesn't really matter. But if you go right here, you can see there is a double spawner. And it's another one of those cool ones where they're not exactly even. You can see this one is a block higher than that one. You know, a block or two, which I always thought was pretty cool. But it's a double zombie spawner. And they each have a, a chest in them, too. And it's right here with the village, with the stronghold. So you are really set. I mean, right here is your XP grinder all ready to go. And obviously, most of, these most of the time, you know, they go into caves. This one, I don't know if it does. But I'm also not sure what else is under here, so... A little bit of exploring could go a long way. I mean, there could be a mine shaft over here. I just don't remember. But yeah, that's uh, pretty much the best part of this map right here. And the fact it's got the stronghold is just an added bonus because it gives you a ton to do. And you'll always have the village to come back to. So it's pretty great. But uh, yeah, see, the map is uh, good too. Up in the top there, I almost forgot to mention, this is a mushroom biome. So this map has everything because it's also got mountains all the way down in the bottom that way kind of the way I'm, I'm pointing so you've got it all you've got everything you need and this village comes complete with its own XP double spawner grinder and stronghold so I hope you enjoy this video and be sure to look out for more and I'll talk to you guys next time